What's up guys, this is Edward Hummeldorf, and welcome to a comparing extinct to animals to their modern counterparts video. In today's comparison video, I'll be comparing the mammoth and the mastodon to today's elephants. Like today's elephants on the African and Asian plains, the mammoth and mastodon's massive size made them difficult to kill. You may also be wondering which of the two are more is closely more closely related to today's elephants. Well, the answer is the mammoth, like today's elephants, has similar grinding teeth for grinding tough grass, while mastodons had knobby teeth for crushing tough wood, aquatic plants, and broad leaves and woody stems. This means the mastodon is a more distant relative of today's elephants, while mammoths are the cl are more closely related to elephants. Of course, you may notice that mammoths and mastodons are a lot hairier than today's elephants because they lived in colder climates. And also, the mammoth is bigger than the mastodon, obviously because of the tusks and the size of the animal. And just like today's elephants, mammoths and mastodons lived in herds led by a matriarch or a top female. And as for the, the adult males, they live alone, only finding herds during mating season. And because mammoths and mastodons ate different things, this concludes that they didn't compete for the same thing because they ate different things because the main difference between them is in their teeth, as I mentioned before. Also, let me know in the comments below what other differences you notice between the mammoth and the mastodon, and how they compare to today's elephants. As you can see, these pictures are of the mammoth and mastodon in augmented reality. And you may be wondering of how I got these pictures. Well, I scan QR codes on the Rancho La Brea Tar Pits website, and, I got, and these were the results on my phone camera. And that's all I know about comparing the elephants to, to the extinct mammoths and mastodons. In the next com Ice Age comparison video, I'll be comparing the Harlan's ground sloth and the Shasta ground sloth to the modern three-toed and two-toed sloths. Well, I hope you all learned something from this video today. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to be on the lookout for the ground sloth and tree sloth comparison video that I'll be making next. Anyways, I hope you have a nice day. Bye-bye.